work with one let's use the app library so to access the app library you slide to the furthest page okay and then you slide to the left one more time and then you can see here we have the app library so this will have a bunch of folders which are automatically generated you can see the categories here suggestions recently added utilities all of that good stuff now here is the deal you use the app library in order to hide apps on the home screen but still keep them on your device so let's say the watch app here you barely ever use this or never use it you can long press on the app tap on remove app and instead of selecting delete app which completely removes the watch app from your device you can instead select remove from home screen and what's really cool is you can remove any app from the home screen even the native apps built into ios or ipad os then from here let's go to the app library and you can see the watch app is still available in the app library what was removed from the home screen you can also search up for the app you removed from the home screen as well now here is the deal what if you want to have a new application you download be removed uh, from the home screen but go into the app library well, what you do is you go to settings you then find here home screen and you see here newly downloaded apps by default it's set to add to home screen you're going to select it app library only and so when you download a brand new app from the app store instead of going to the home screen maybe you have this home screen set up that you like or instead it's going to go to the app library so your home screen setup will not be changed when you download new applications of course if you want to uh, bring back an application which was uh, in the app library but removed from the home screen you find the app drag drop back on the home screen and you can see the watch app which i removed earlier is now back available if you can't immediately find the app you can always just search it up let's say watch and then drag and drop it back to the home screen like so another thing as well is in the app library you may notice these smaller folders so you have these large apps and then you have this smaller folder if you tap into this one you can see this will just give you a big list of all the apps in the category so you have the utility category these larger apps you know that you don't can't expand into if you tap on the app it'll go into the app itself but then you have these folders when you tap on the folder there boom it will uh, enlarge the application if you ever want apps to go back onto the home screen you just go back to the home screen page of settings tap on add to home screen and all new applications you download will show up in the home screen so with that being said thanks for watching see you guys later bye bye